All right, what's up guys? Legacy Junior here, and today we're dropping my truck, La Mamalona. It's a little dirty right now because uh, the whole fires and winters and all that is going on. This is gonna be the last time you guys see it sitting like this. That hood though, huh? Yeah, sitting like a monster truck right now. So I'm dropping it off on my boy's Brutal Customs on Instagram. Uh, he does drops, uh, shock relocations, tubs, uh, notches, anything you guys need for your trucks, hit them up. He's gonna be doing all the work for my truck. And uh, like I said, the truck's hella dirty right now, so I don't wanna drop off the truck like that to him because this is how it's, how it's gonna be. So I'm gonna run into the rocks real quick and then we're gonna go over there and uh, meet up in an hour. Squeak clean, out the wash. Yeah. I don't detail car like this. This is just how I'm doing it right now. Today. <laughs> We're going to get the Brutal now, and then uh, we're going to drop it off for baby about a week. So, yeah, stay tuned and uh, keep up with the process. Alright guys, so I went to go drop the truck off at Brutal's house yesterday, and um, everything went smooth, you know what I mean? The whole plan, everything there. I might be doing more modifications to the truck than I really wanted to at the beginning of it. But, I mean, if I'm already there doing it, might as well. Uh, it's a new day today, so obviously you can tell. I'm wearing something different. Uh, I'm going with my boy Smokey. He's going to drop off his Camaro to go get a swap done on it. He's taking out the LS1 Pro Charger out of it. And uh, he's going to throw in something different. I don't know if he wants me to tell you guys what he's going to do yet. So, I'm going to ask him first. See, see, what, see what he wants to do. But, yeah, we're going to drive over there right now. And, uh, yeah. Big rotors. Oh, that's one pro charge. <laughs> Bro, it's just no joke. Stupid loud. Because uh, you got a manual fan switch. Oh, so you got to turn on manually before you do it? Like yeah, when you turn the car on? That's what he put on, but I'm going to take that shit on. Well, you have it literally on a switch? Yeah, All right, there. And hey, don't you be getting nervous like you forget to turn on the fan on, though? Oh, well, yeah. I mean, I haven't even driven it this damn thing. And around the block. I was going to put mine on a, fan, on a fan, too, but... But I'm hella forgetful, yeah, bro. I'm gonna put it in the back of the slot, bro. The uh, um, Casper's electronics, they got a little uh, a plug and play. Uh, you literally plug it into the already harness where there's a plug, and, and that lets you turn the, the fans on earlier if you want. Really? But they, they keep the stock operating. Why do you put it on a switch? Just because it's easier? Because when you do a pro charger, you got to delete the double fans. Because uh, it gets in the way, and you go with one big ass single fan. It's the run cool though? Yeah. place than what you guys are used to so just like bear with me you know what i mean it's gonna be like a whole week combined into one video but yeah if you're enjoying right now subscribe leave a like follow me on instagram legacy junior you know do what you gotta do oh shit speed bump but yeah we got off the car my boy's marrow and now we got some bowling crab it's time to eat you feel me Oh, chinga, 
All right, guys, so this video is being taken probably like a week or two after you guys see me drive my truck off. My boy's Meryl. The arms that I got from my truck aren't the correct arms. Shit happens. Um, they're torsion bar arms, which usually come for four wheel drive trucks, even though mine's a two wheel drive. But uh, it's all I know is it's longing it out. You know what I mean? But this is part of it. You know what I mean? Like, obviously, I'm hella impatient. All my truck dropped and all that. But it is what it is. Sometimes you gotta be patient. No, I'm trying to be doing burnouts right now, but shit, it is what it is. I uh, know at the end of this, it should be dropped. Tocando, mamalona. Hey, you looking good. Uh, so I don't know where the video is going to pick up from here, but uh, hopefully it's me and my truck, and I'm like doing burnouts, 360s, whipping it out for me. <laughs> guns out, blunt. No, I'm just playing. But no, yeah, so I'll see you guys on the next clip. Right, so we picked up the truck yesterday, last night from Brutal. Thank you, Brutal. Truck came out amazing, ride super smooth, but it needed alignment. So we're here at Auto Sports 209 on IG. And they're gonna get down, we're gonna throw two new tires up in front and get the alignment done. The toe and camber, everything readjusted. And we're gonna take it for a drive and see how it goes. The good news and bad news, truck is driving way more straight than it was before in, but I do need to rebuild the whole front end on it. Just like the tie rod ends, maybe um, in center links, uh, idle, idle arms. Everything needs to get practically rebuilt for the whole front end and my truck should be 100% It's driving straight, but the wheel isn't going 100% straight. So it's kind of like iffy, but She sound good Thank you all the support for taking care of me good customer service 110% recommend them Really take care of your car. They take care of your vehicle like it's one of theirs Did the best they can but always you gotta get this whole front end rebuilt, but we'll see Before I reveal the truck, I'm doing a giveaway with three Legacy Performance shirts, just like this one. In order to win, you gotta follow me on Instagram at Legacy Junior. Subscribe to this channel you're watching right now at Legacy Junior, and comment your favorite vehicle or your dream car down below. I'm gonna put the names in a generator, and it's gonna pick the winners, three different winners. Let's get to the truck. No, hold on, no, 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 no Yep, guys, I went with a 5.9 drop. Once again, big thanks to Brutal Customs. Took care of the truck, looks completely different truck. Actually, really hyped with the truck how it all came out. So what I did is I went with a fine on drop with a C-notch uh, helper bags in the back, just what I want to tow. It's not a big problem. And got the helper bags pressure gauge right here. You see it? I went ahead and asked them to do the tubs all in the back for clearance. Helper bags right there, as you can see. I know in the previous video you guys see me install the new hood struts, but he tubbed the front of the truck also, so those had to come out. But I bought some brand new actual hood struts. Those were like just the clamps. These ones gonna go to the top by I think they're I think they're made by Reckless. Yeah, they're made by Reckless, so they're a good brand. And he went ahead and actually put a different intake on it as well. But by the way, for the intake, it's not really gonna be the intake is gonna stay on my truck. I'm gonna go with something else, but this is good right now for temporary because I think my previous one, the actual stock one that comes with the truck, it hits the tubs, so you gotta take them out. But besides that, everything's smooth. My truck is 100%. <sighs> Swell on mine, and I'm happy. Now I can really. <laughs> so, once again, big thanks to Brutal Customs and Auto Sports for allowing my truck. Uh, the truck came out more than I wanted, honestly. The truck is looks. You already know, man. You know yeah, right. but let me know what you guys think about the truck leave a comment down below let me know what you guys think was it too low can i go lower do you like it do you feel like it's just the right amount i'm legacy junior and i'm out peace